I'm here with Anthony um, from SUSE. We're at the Finos Conference. What is SUSE, Anthony? So SUSE is a enterprise open source uh, company. We've been in business now for 30 years, which okay. is only one year younger than Linux itself, so the open source movement. Um, and we focus on open, bringing open source technologies to the enterprise. Uh, we do two di different technologies. We focus in on Linux and the OS uh -huh. uh, with SUSE Linux Enterprise Server. And then we also focus on Kubernetes uh, with the tools like Rancher, New Vector, uh, Stack State. And that's really focused on uh, Kubernetes orchestration. So when, when you're dealing with enterprise, like right now, obviously, Finos heavily into financial technology mm -hmm. and um, the banking. So how are you working with the financial shops and the larger organizations? Sure. So when we, when we talk to large financial organizations, they're most interested in is, is around security for yes. obvious reasons. Uh, just beyond the, the entry level security, they're looking for something, for example, like secure supply, uh, se secure software supply chain or like a SaaS certification. At SUSE, we have all the major certifications that comes to that. We are FIP certified. We have the SALSA certification from Google. So they can be assured that when they get software from us, it's been fully tested, been uh, making sure we don't have any kind of vulnerabilities that are uh, well known and, and we don't have any uh, bad actors in, in the software supply chain itself. All right, so, so speaking of the um, software supply chain, and looking at that, you know, obviously when you're dealing with open source and different libraries, mm -hmm. management becomes an issue. So are you building tools to help them or do you um, just work with the process? Like how does how does it work at SUSE? So actually we do it on both sides. So uh -huh. we do the software itself and we have tooling around the securing the OS uh, with our SUSE manager product or SUSE multi Linux uh, manager. Uh, not managing just our OS, but actually uh, all the Linuxes out there for enterprise Linuxes. Okay. And then on the Kubernetes side, we do uh, for a, su a secure supply chain for software, for your software, we use a tool called New Vector and we protect the supply chain. And then uh, we also have a tool called Stack State that will go in and look at the behavior of your application and report back on it. Okay. So any any kind of, let's say, miss, uh, let's say, uh, aberrant behavior will be instantly detected and blocked. Okay. No, that, that makes that makes total sense. Like, I know there's there's various tools that, like, from an application performance monitoring, mm -hmm. but looking at it from a security perspective right. and monitoring any um, anomalies and things of that nature for the application itself. Uh, yeah, absolutely. So our new vector tool, we don't use a whitelist. We don't use any kind of algorithm. What we do for security is we watch the behavior of your application and we create a profile based on that behavior. So once you're satisfied with the profile, you put it into a protect mode, and any anomalies whatsoever, unknown vulnerabilities, will be instantly blocked. Oh, that's really that's really interesting. How many times have you been to the Finos conference? This is my first time. Uh, so I'm looking forward. I, I would love to get out to some sessions. You know, I'm waiting for other colleagues to come to relieve me. Okay. Uh, but yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm totally looking forward to some of these sessions. Well, Anthony, listen, thanks for talking to us at Tech Behind FinTech. We really appreciate it. Anytime, anytime. Thank Take you. Take care. Understanding the technology that powers the money is essential. Knowing the business drivers that inspire how the money is made is crucial. Bridging the gap between the mind of the technologist and the mind of the business is monumental. That is what TBF is all about. Let's start this never-ending conversation. It's time.